So this is KMnO4, and in this flask there is hydrogen peroxide H2O2. So we are going to do redox reaction. As we know that H2O2 can behave as both the oxidizing agent as well as reducing agent, but we know that the KMnO4 is strong oxidizing agent. So let's see what happens. You see, it's available in the market. This is KMnO4, 20 rupees, right? And this hydrogen peroxide, just 30 rupees. In the market, you can see in the name of perhydron because it releases oxygen, right? Now, let's see what is going to happen. Let me add some color to it. Pinch of this color, pinch of this color, and same I'm doing over here. Let's see in which the reaction is going to release oxygen faster. Okay, and this is our Avengers batch, you know, Ambika Ma'am, Shreyas, Capto Sir, Vedix, Ambika Ma'am, Bio, Vaseem Sir, you know very well, Chemistry, and myself, you are just Vibhava, right? So, in both these flasks, this is round bottom flask, and that is conical one, right? We are having hydrogen peroxide, and we are going to compare in which the reaction is going to release oxygen faster. So everything is prepared. Just let me add KMnO4 to it and let's see what is going to happen. To which should I add KMnO4 first? This one or that one? Okay, first let me add KMnO4 to this. Let's see what is going to happen. Okay. Oh my God. What is this? See. See what's coming out it's oxygen kids it's oxygen now let me add some more KMnO4 to this oxidizing agent is strong oxidizing agent see what's happening over here and this is the oxygen coming out you can see very clearly kids now the same thing I'm going to do in this conical plus let's see what happens let me add KMnO4 to this and let me add some uh, washing this that's why reaction is not that vigorous we cannot see the foams coming out because oxygen got released oxygen got released uh, let me bring some dishwash now oxygen was getting released but we are not able to see see kids once again I am adding some KMnO4 to it and as the oxygen gas is going to get released but we cannot see the intensity of oxygen too much now if i am going to add some dish wash now see kids now definitely you can see better the oxygen is coming out see kids this is carbonate sodium carbonate it will produce some foam now see since um, should I add? Should I add? Yay! Three, two, one, and let's see what's going to happen. Okay, see, this is elephant toothpaste. It's coming out. You can see it's coming out because the foam is having oxygen and the oxygen is coming out in this form and this is going to form elephant to paste now the same if i add over here this is your h2o2 if i add a little bit of h2o2 in this along with the some dishwash let's see what happens over here same same go 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 it's gone and now let's see okay now see what's going to happen over here now see kids hey same same So, let me add some more H2O2 to it and then let's see. 
Oh yeah! Wow, the elephant toothpaste. Once again, we have seen that this oxygen is getting released. Can you see this one? The oxygen is getting released from here. You can see now continuously the oxygen is coming out because Cabinophore is reacting with hydrogen peroxide and it is producing nascent oxygen and that is combining to form O2 and it's coming in the form of this froth or you can say foam because it's making fluffy. So all the best kids. Okay, that's it.